Hey, how's it going? We're playing some more Sly. Let's go ahead and get us started here. Let's take a look at the ThiefNet. Any new moves that we can buy? So we bought all those. L drop O. I think that's everything. We currently have all of the moves. So let's go ahead and get out. Let's grab our boy Sly. And let's make our way into the town. Again, we just got here. We just... Uh, beat the cheeks of uh el jefe or whatever his name was also it looks like we didn't get everything from the last map probably at the end of the game we'll like go around and finish them up i'm definitely gonna get all the bottles and safes okay so let's go ahead and start the first mission here in the wild west myself arrested i trust you bentley but i'm not sure about getting locked up in this town sorry sly it's the only way we're gonna reach tennessee in time there's just one problem they're holding kid cooper in the backs of a security wing to get yourself thrown in there you're gonna have to gain outlaw status so you need to make sure you build a rep before they catch you otherwise they'll throw you in with the common criminals Ugh. You mean like jaywalkers and litterbugs? Not gonna happen. Well, around these parts, it's probably more like goat thieves and tobacco spinners. But you get the point. For starters, why don't you try defacing all those posters of the sheriff around town? That ought to put a burr under his saddle. Get it? Uh-huh. <laughs> Well, I thought it was funny, Bentley. So wouldn't it be easier to just commit like five acts of homicide and call it a day? Ooh. Well, whatever is easier, I guess. Boing. Totally missed that jump. We're just not going to talk about it. You guys never saw anything. Yo, turn around, bro. What are you doing? Why are you looking at me? You could be looking a million other places and you decide that you want to look at me. All right, well, let's go behind you then. Don't mind me while I deface his poster. Make it look goofy and move on. Just like junior high. Sly in middle school confirmed. Not for sale. All right, so my game keeps crashing. So I did get a bunch of bottles and a bunch of treasure, but of course none of it got saved. So here we are again. I'm just gonna go ahead and do it a second time. So let's see what treasures we got. So the tier 2 is a deputy badge. Very, very cool. Let's go ahead and run around and grab some bottles. Like I said, technically I already have grabbed these bottles once before. Um, but hey, maybe because I've grabbed them already, maybe we can just kind of speed run the bottles. Now I think I got like 11. So I didn't grab a crazy, crazy amount here. If only I could not fall off buildings, that would also be very, very cool. Is there another bottle over there? There probably is going to be a bottle there, but I'm going to leave it for now. I'm going to try to grab all these high-rise bottles up on these big old buildings. Where are you, bottles? And definitely this map. And again, I, I can't... I don't know what I've said and what I haven't said already. Um, but I guess I'll repeat what I said earlier. That I love this map. I remember this map much more, but what's cool about it is there's a lot less foliage on this map. The last map had leaves and trees and bushes absolutely everywhere, which made the green bottles much, much harder to find. It also made navigating a little tougher, and it also probably killed my emulator. Um, but in this map, it's pretty desolate, which helps finding the bottles, because the bottles are in pretty, like, starch contrast. But... Let's go ahead and... Ooh, see, there's another bottle there. Let's grab this treasure here. And let's run it back to our base. We only got 30 seconds, but... I don't think I'll need more than 30 seconds. Alright, so there's a bottle there. There's a bottle behind me. And I think there's... I just saw a bottle behind the building. So there is already three bottles that we'll have to kind of swipe right away. Alright, there's the treasure. Now, I don't know who in the world would sell a sign for 140 gold but um hey 
If someone wants to buy it for 140 gold off me, you go ahead and do that. Bruh. Really? Alright, here we go. Boink. Alright, and now we know that there is one bottle over there and one bottle at the wagon. So let's grab, let's go ahead and grab this one first. Let's head over to the wagons. Because we know there's one over here. And also see one on top of that other building also. I know I should probably just get to a high place and speed this process up, but... Nah, there we go. There we go. We got it. We got it. Okay, then there's a bottle up on top of this building. Which, you know, I'm gonna slurp right up. Alright, there we go. We already have one-third of this map done. And we're basically still in the first mission here. But they're just so out in the open. I can't help but, uh... Again, slurp them up. Alright, treasure time. What is this, like a poison tonic? Alright, how much time do we have? 20... 30 seconds? That's not too bad, considering the hideout is... Basically right here. As long as we don't get shot by that dude. We should be fine. We have 15 seconds to run up this. I think we have more than enough time for that. Oh, is my emulator about to crash? Looking a bit rough on the frame rate. Don't crash. Let me save and then you could crash if you want. Bottle of sarsaparilla. I don't know what sarsaparilla is, but that seems cool. Can I save? Let me go ahead and save. Yeah, let's go ahead and save because I'm not losing <laughs> another save file. I'm not going to do this a second time, basically. And I know um, I will not be judging the game based upon my crashes. I know that's more of an emulator thing, so don't worry. I'm not At the end of the game, I'm not going to say this game is trash because it kept uh, crashing. It's not the game's fault. It is um, the emulator and the port's fault, so don't worry about that. That is not going to be one of the scoring criteria for this game. I know there's a, a bottle up top. My question is, how do I get up top? I know I can slide on these rails, can I? Skirt. But I don't actually want to do that right now. Got a little treasure on you, bud? No treasure. You're useless. I also hear a bottle, though. Is that bottle? No, it's above me. Is it under or below? I think it's... It's above, right? Okay, that didn't work out the way I wanted it to. Oh! He actually scared the crap out of me. Because it's definitely not up there. Oh yeah, it's probably in this barn. Oh yeah. There you are. Yeah, it sounded like it was above us, but I could see how maybe it wasn't. I'm dedicating hunting of bottles. I don't know if that made any sense, but... And once I get to the last one or two, that's when it's going to get a little rougher. And I'll probably need to turn off the music to hear for the dink, 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 dink. There's got to be a bottle on this bridge somewhere. wonder if we can just find it and grab it right now. Oh, and also, I just thought about it. Kid Cooper's got a gun. I've been seeing these, basically, targets around this map, but I've also seen them in the last map, meaning I'm pretty sure they're going to be the Tennessee Kid Cooper's special ability, meaning that in the last map, I probably couldn't have even gotten all the collectibles without getting all of the characters, I'm assuming. So... I'm not going to go too hard on myself for not finding all the collectibles, because I'm pretty sure a lot of them I wouldn't be able to get, even if I wanted them. Alright, there's got to be a... Uh... got to be a bottle around here somewhere, right? We've gone a hot minute without finding a bottle. But I do see treasure. Oh, please don't... No, I lost my treasure! Look at you shooting your gun up in the air like a doofus. Ah! Leave me alone. Alright, that's okay. Let's uh, keep looking for treasure then. We'll uh, we'll come back to that treasure. We know it's there. That's the important part is that we know it's there. And I ain't gonna forget about it. Oh, is that another piece of treasure? Is that a golf club? Okay. Well, let's try to get this piece of treasure back home then. 
Again, we know where the other one is. So it's not really not that big of a deal. And maybe we'll try to utilize the train tracks next time. Um... As long as I can get back with about 10 seconds to spare, I think we'll make it. They don't tend to make these challenges very hard, to be honest. You don't have to do, like, special moves to get up, you know. Yeah, I have over 20 seconds to basically run up these stairs. Easy peasy. Probably would have made the other one, too, if I didn't get shot in the head. Br oh, it's a branding iron. It's not a golf club. It's like, is this some, like... Did they even... I don't think golf existed back... Back here? Back then? Let's go ahead and uh, de defile another poster, though, while we're at it. In case the game crashes, we have this checkpoint. Probably. That's why I'm wearing glasses. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Stinks. Got him, Sly. Got him. Any other bottles in the vicinity? What up, lizard? You just jump over this wall, right? Really? Okay. You wanna... Oh, you have treasure. Well, I'm gonna kill you, but I'm also gonna take your treasure first. What do you got? Gold nugget. Looks a little bit like a limestone or something, but... If you don't mind me, let me just go ahead and... I can't deface this, really? I guess I have to deface him one at a time. <laughs> All right, Sly. I didn't realize he was one for for the rules, but uh, sure, why not? All right. We know there's at least one treasure and a couple of bottles up in this direction. You can also ride the rails, right? Yum. Let's go this way though. Any bottles along the rail track? Oh, I see a little treasure along the rail track. Let's go ahead and grab that. We know what we gotta do. Let's go ahead and ride the rails. Just like a certain somebody that I'm pretty sure we'll meet in a little while here. Alright, we got 15 seconds to get up the stairs. No problem, no problem. I probably should find a better way to get up to the hideout, but... I mean, if it works, don't fix it, right? Or if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Whatever that stupid saying is. What is this? Temporal flux driver. I don't believe that's a real thing. What in the world would we... Why is there a temporal flux driver in this period? Doom, da -dum -dum -dum. Thank you for the bottle. I'm trying to head back to... Where we, where we lost that one treasure. Because I think that's what's... I want to get that before we do anything else. So we don't forget about it. Can also check if there's any bottles in this bridge. Doesn't look like it. Oh yeah, that's a bottle. Like, is that a bottle I hear? That is definitely a bottle that I hear. Ah, there you are, bud. Trying to hide from me, huh? Nobody can hide from me. Another bottle. It's on this side, I think. Under the bridge? Nope. It's around here somewhere. I can hear it. I can smell you. Maybe I can see it while climbing? Is it above me? Oh, it was above me. I really need to get better about looking upwards. I look downwards a lot. I never look upwards. Alright, that's going to be probably important at a later date. Do I, I don't see any bottles up there. Well, I guess we might as well grab the treasure that we know it's right here. Yeah, let's grab this. Little cactus plant. Is it a cactus with jewels in it? I feel like there's better things to put your jewels inside of. But who am I to say? Nope, wrong way. There we go. Let's use the railway to our advantage. I think this should get us pretty close to our house. Oh, yeah. I don't know if this is the only way to be able to get this treasure in time, but that definitely helps. 
and we will go ahead and save again. I know we've basically spent the past 20 minutes just getting bottles and treasures, but we're going to have to do them at some point, right? We might as well just uh, do them now, because actually, I enjoy the treasures and the bottles more than the game itself, basically. Then save the game again once again. I'm just being persistent on saving because um, the game likes to crash. And that's all I have to say, I guess. The game likes to crash. And I'm not in the mood of redoing things over and over again, so. See, that's going to be another thing that I'm pretty sure we're going to have to have a, an Ancestor Cooper do. Because there's a lot of things on the other map that I just didn't know what they did, but I just like ignored it because I'm like, whatever. Maybe it's just a weird design choice, but no, they seem to actually do something. And the, these things do something also, and I don't know what they do. Because I saw some of those in the past map too. But I'm not going to try to think too hard right now. One at a time. Also, these rocks, they look like cheddar. Ooh, another piece of treasure. Well, we'll have to come back for that treasure, because right now I'm looking for these bottles, and... If three of them are in my sights, I'm not going to let them be um, over here somewhere. Let's grab this one because it's, once again, in my sight here. Okay. 20 bottles already. Look at us go. Alright, and I see two there, so we're going to have 22 by the end of this. Bonk. Right? Do I hear another one? Can I jump on the train? Oh, the train passed. No, I don't think there's another one. Well, I think that's all of them in just the near vicinity. If that is the case, let's go ahead and grab that treasure. I don't want to forget about the treasures either. Where's their hideout? Our hideout is over there. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's right behind it. Oh, yeah. Oh, they only gave us like 30 seconds for this one. So this one's a little tougher to get to. There's another bottle. Noted. I don't know all of the ways to get up to our hideout. Is this a way? Looks like it is a way. Very cool. Another treasure. Here we go. What is this? Goofy hat? Oh, 10 gallon hat. Okay, that makes more sense. Alright, there's a bottle on you. Oh, actually, I need to go get that one for sure. Okay, one minute. So say we'll leave the rest of the bottles by chance. We'll find them during the mission, but you know what? I have to get at least this one here, right? Boing. Alright. Can I jump on the train? This is my question. Ah. Oh, I just got blickied by the train. What? Okay. Noted. You cannot <laughs> ride on the train. They, they literally did it in slide, slide 2. In slide 2, they let me ride on trains. Why are they all of a sudden, like, killer? Like, what? Alright, apparently these trains just go faster or something. I don't know. I want your treasure, bud. Gimme, gimme. Hello? Don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around. No! Just, uh, forget I was here. Whoa. Bro, why do you got a gold nugget, bro? You got... I still want it, though. It's cheap, but I still want it. Oh, that's not somewhere I should be running off to. Oh, he sees me. All right, you know what? I don't care. Let me just go ahead and do this. If I was as homely as this guy, I would not hang my picture everywhere. Excellent work, Fly. I wish I could tear them down. Here's Weakling of the West. I love how the enemies get replaced. All of a sudden, there's just a dude with no treasure. Feels bad. My treasure's gone. All right, let's go this way. Now, I wonder, is there a bottle up there? There might be, but there's got to be a better way to get up there if that's the case. Let's also try not to get smoked by this train again. 
I already did it one time. Choo choo. Oh! Sorry. We got choo chooed. Oh, yo, you got treasure? You mind if I do? If you turn around, I will murder your family. Thank you for the gold nugget. I'm not gonna even. Yo. Where's your rope? See, now I don't feel so bad about threatening his family. He clearly was not a very nice guy. Unlike me, I'm always nice. I don't think Bane begins to describe this guy. I mean, we saw the dude in the window earlier. He's pretty short. Oh, look at those! Improvement. Look at those I'll noodle arms. One, the homely buckaroo. Bro, he does the opposite of ar of arm days at the gym. Now, where's our next thingy? Ooh, homeboy's got some treasure though. Don't mind if I do. You wanna just sit there for a while? I mean, just take a load off. All right, deputy badge. I still don't think we've seen the tier 3 treasure yet. We've seen the nuggets and we've seen the deputy badges, but we haven't seen anything else. I will also take that bottle. Let's go ahead and take the take the rails here. Let's see what we can find. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a quick saber root here. Once again, not trying to lose my uh Unless if the game crashes, but I don't finish the mission, does it not save the mission? If that is the case, let's go ahead and, um, let's just finish this mission here. <laughs> now I'm paranoid. <gasps> collectible. We take those. We don't usually see collectibles just out in the wild with no form of, like, trickery or ability. They just, it was just chilling there. That's pretty rare. Seems like all the other collectibles beforehand took a little bit of work to get to or... You know, took a little bit of... Took at least two brain cells. Sheriff puts up posters of himself. This guy, apparently. Nice work, Sly. You're a regular Picasso. I love a challenge. I call it Ten Star Loser. Interesting. All right, last poster. Here we go. This guy's a real egomaniac. What is he writing? I can't even tell. I'm going to find this artist and box his thumbs and maybe his pinky. My thumbs? <laughs> Not my pinky, I need that. What a toothpick. Got one of those right here. I Ooh, just dropped it. Definitely got under his skin, Sly. You ready for phase two? Absolutely. Apparently, the sheriff also loves lollipops. But his favorite is a particular Cuban variety, which has to be shipped in specially. Supposedly, they taste like rice and beans. Ugh, gross. Agreed. But That's if pretty good to me. About, he'll have to wait weeks for the next shipment, and that should really tick him off. I mean, it'd be weird trying to eat candy and tasting rice and beans, but rice and beans themselves taste delicious. So, get a little bit of, like... I love Mexican food, dude. I will smash a taco and a quesadilla, dude. Whew. I'm talking black black margarita, blue margarita. Any, like, little Mexican, like, hole-in-the-wall restaurant. Oh, I'm gonna smash. My lollipop. Toothpicks lollipop. Does he just have his, like, lollipop stashed around the map? Oh, so everything we've been doing hasn't made us a criminal? Interesting. Alright, this is going perfectly. You'll be locked up in no time. You know, you're a little too excited about sending me to the slammer, Bentley. It's all about the job, Sly. Speaking of which, in case you hadn't noticed, this Sheriff Toothpick is his own biggest fan. 
In fact, it looks like he's throwing himself a festival, and it's in full swing. If you take that banner down, I'm sure it'll be the final straw. Right. Let's go rain on this guy's parade. Let's do it. Um, so do I gotta climb up it? Now, how in the world do I do something like that? Oh, I probably need to get up to that rooftop over there. That would seem smart. Instead of going lower, we actually have to go higher. I know it takes a lot of brain cells to figure that one out, but... What's your problem, dude? Does you have a stroke or something? Oh, my bad. I can't believe this guy has an appreciation festival for himself. Okay, there's the band. Just need to knock those clothespins off. So, those are big old clothespins. Man's got big laundry. He's this lolly demon outlaw I've been looking for. Shoot him up. Feels bad. Hey yo, we got Jill Bird Sly. Not much of a costume though, is it? I feel like a costume supposed to like disguise us, but like if we're in jail, we're in jail either way, right? If we were wearing normal clothes in jail, we're still in jail. I guess we'll see how we utilize it. Oh shoot, we only got Bentley and Murray now. Alright, let's see. I think we can oh we got some new moves. Trigger bomb, steerable fist, and rail sprint. Hey, we got enough money for all of them, right? Oh, yeah. Look at us go. We absolutely cleaned out the thief net. Let's go and grab... Who did we just... I hope I just grabbed Bentley. I hope. And we almost got all the bottles. We got 36%. We got 4% of bottles to go. So that's what's... That's like five more? Okay. Well, really not a big deal to get them right now, to be honest. I'll probably go for the bottles once I grab either Tennessee Kid or Sly back. Yo, my bad. Never mind. I guess we're not getting treasure. Cause Bentley just have to stick his arm in his butt. Looks like it's up to me to recall the area. I need to get some shots of that prison, but I better keep a low profile. I don't want to alert the guards. Why didn't Sly just do this before he left? Tennessee Kid Cooper are in that high tower. Very spooky tower. That's a solid photo right there. This one? Alright, what are we taking a photo of next, Bentley? I think we're gonna get, definitely get shot by that guy, but I'm not too worried about it. In the world am I supposed to get up there? Oh, there you go. Convenient bounce spot. Okay. What is so interesting? Oh, that cannon looks interesting to me. I'll tell you what. Unless I'm mistaken, that is definitely a munitions dump. Very handy. Probably. Let's go, Bentley. I'm gonna have Bentley start climbing wires. Oh, that's probably not somewhere I should go. Right, where's the next pick? Wait, do I have boosters? Explosive ammo, sleep ammo, shock ammo. Let's get the sleep ammo out. Ooh, a bottle! Free bottle? You love to see it. along the rear wall. I love how he has a little picture of Penelope at the bottom left. Come on, bro. She's been gone for months. Alright, we got 10% of masks. So only about half the masks and half the treasures. 